and welcome back. This is the update on gold. As you can see here, the morning analysis, we were around 1786. We were looking for buys, high risk, high reward buys at 1781. After a possible London pullback to grab some liquidity, don't break 1781, uh, especially if we see multiple rejections at this important price point. As you can see here, we were expecting 1781 as a price point for even sales if we have closures below or a risk reward buys. If we jump on the updated one, you can see that after the analysis, price exactly got rejected at 1785, made a lower uh, liquidity gram to 1781, and then went bullish. As you can see, we're going to see on the one minute never breaking below and actually doing a nice here high risk reward for like 96 pips or above the 1785 price point already 50 pips above as you can see here this was um here this was the time of the analysis we see a strong rejection of the level we're not taking sales we as you can see the yellow lines mean that we are not going to enter, we're not looking for entries there. We are just seeing the price action and waiting for this price point. And as you can see, price went and created a double bottom at 1781. You can enter here, you can enter here with the, it's not my candle setup, this is more of a price point um, entry. You know that this is the PSA, it's a very high risk high reward entry because it can give you all this full range to take advantage of, but still you have multiple uh, opportunities, opportunities, especially for example here, above the previous, uh, previous high, you have an opportunity, two opportunities. If you would zoom in above this previous lower high, you have this candle setup, you have this candle setup for the one that we back test for the high risk high reward medium risk you still have plenty of range to take advantage of you still have here is much less but you have uh, okay, 10 pips 15 pips stop loss but still it's not our job to determine which is the range as you can see here the price is giving you from high risk high reward entry 60 70 pips of course if you leave the um, as a scalper this is more than enough especially you know that this is a price point you probably have the tp exactly at this level as least i think you should have and then you have this full range to take advantage of price is giving you also second entry much um in a much different point which is sh showing you that is much better in inside. This is not a pre-planned price point. This one gives you in a much less time, it gives you more than 70 pips. As you can see, break and retest above the PSA. If you took the first, the first setups here, here, these two candles combined, you could have got like with 15 pips, still plenty of range. Even here, this this candle, and you still have your know, 19, 20 pips. Not what we want since we look for we're looking for uh, 30 pips. If you risk only 10 pips, because in this case it's more than enough, then you also get your one to two. But as you can see, this price action was not clear. Still, you, you, even if you take a loss, you take uh, take out at break even here, or you yeah. After you see the rejection, you see price going up, and price is retracing. You are safe because your stop loss is still intact. You see this move, then you are never going to take the full stop loss because you have too many with signs of Thorstone. And this is not the momentum. So you take a, um, a break even lot 
we give a read and you are fully aware. Look at this. This is uh, close to uh, not to New York opening, but still look at this setup. Closing gap in liquidity, closing above. This is much nicer because New York is opening, makes a lower week. This is the safest entry because you have New York opening making a lower week, failing to break the PSA, and this one with New York volume is going to give you like 40 pips much easier with the volume time. I hope you guys um oh, I was clear enough with the higher risk I would as you can see why why the talent setup was not valid. It was not a single candle went below 1781. That's why you have this higher risk I would entry, safer entries. And if you got this you are good to go. You don't need even to take. Maybe you only take the uh, second entry scaling in here. You see that only 20 pips above, and you're good to go. If you are still only um, for New York, you see the momentum, you play the momentum. You know that New York probably will give you a retracement, but you know that probably New York is going to give you quick uh, pips. Could have got like these minus also back to here so you at least 20 pips or even to 1789 uh, but still even if you was enter here even new york doesn't break your price point and gives you those 45 pips very easily